G'day guys, now I'm going to show you this video, I want you to share it, make this viral, let's expose Tennis Australia. Uh, this video has slipped out, uh, it's from Rod Laver Arena at the Australian Open, which should be renamed the Australian Closed, seeing as they don't allow the number one tennis player in the world, Novak Djokovic, to play. He's been detained, it's a disgrace. Now what's more of a disgrace is this footage you're about to see here, which is proof that Tennis Australia is targeting Novak, not because of medical reasons or visa reasons, but it's some kind of a uh, you know, political attack on him. Some of his fans are at Love Rod Laver Arena. They've paid money. They've bought tickets. They're watching the tennis. And security actually walked up to them and said, you can't have Novak Djokovic signs here. It's inappropriate. And they said, hand over the signs. We're confiscating him. Now, well done to these people. They were staunch. They said, no, we're not giving you the signs. We support Novak. What's wrong with that? And they were actually kicked out. They asked to leave. And one of the ladies was secretly filming. Awesome job. Well done. Always film the police and film security. And this security guard on camera, on behalf of Tennis Australia, admitted that Tennis Australia has said no signs for Novak Djokovic and it's inappropriate to support him. Now, this is a bloody disgrace. This is un-Australian. This is an embarrassment. The whole world is watching Australia. The damage that Dan Andrews and Scott Morrison have done to the tourist industry is going to take years to repair. The Australian Open, as with all of these big major sporting events, was a big draw card for tourists and for you know uh, spending and for money to come into the city of Melbourne into Australia. It's a bloody disgrace. Novak Djokovic, he's not only going to win the Australian Open, he's going to he's already won the hearts and minds of the Australian people in the world. Scott Scott Morrison, Dan Andrews, you guys just resign. The further you go, the worse it gets. Watch this footage, share it all around. It's outrageous. We've put subtitles in. It was filmed secretly, and we've exposed Tennis Australia targeting Novak Djokovic. Share this video. Make it go viral. Novak, we stand with you. So here we are in Rod Laver Arena at the Tyranny Republic of Melbourne. Apparently, you're not allowed to have a Novak Djokovic sign on Sunny Court. Apparently, it's a security claim, and they want to confiscate, aka steal my signs that I've paid some money for. So, Yes, come on, there's rules of entry and we haven't broken any rule of entry. But, but what's, what's the rule that's been broken at the end of the day? Yeah, what's the rule? There's rules of entry and we haven't broken any. There's rules of entry and complied with the rules of entry. The signs are not appropriate. How are they not appropriate? There's no swear words. There's nothing defamatory on the signs. No. According to who and what? I could say your name's not appropriate. Are we, are we not allowed to comment about Novak? I want to stand up against him. I have to keep holding down. If I could have to keep it. If I could have to keep it. If I could have to you, you need to tell us what's inappropriate. I'm in charge of the You still haven't told us what's inappropriate about it. It's an inappropriate sign. So I'm asking you to either hand your sign over. Sorry, mate, listen. I'm asking you to either hand your sign over or I'm asking you to leave. Wait, what's inappropriate about it? What's inappropriate about it? You know exactly what I'm talking about. Tell me what's inappropriate about it. Exactly what I'm talking about. No, we don't. You're telling us. Correct. It's a no-action. What's wrong with Nova? What's wrong with supporting Nova? What is wrong with Nova? Tennis Australia have asked me to take the signs off. Pardon? Tennis Australia. Tennis Australia.